for another hair video and also I told you guys I'll be updating you on my hair and things like that I was on a hair journey after I got my hair cut about a year ago I say I don't know exactly how long ago it was sorry I should have checked that and I just cut my hair yesterday again so yeah <laughs> I'm going to take my hair down for you guys and show you how it looks it's pretty unhealthy at this stage in my hair <laughs> So, I don't know if you guys can see it, but I just cut it yesterday and I'm kind of upset about it because it's a lot shorter than it was, in my opinion. Oh, sorry. So... I don't know um if you watch my video I think it's something about coconut oil save I don't know something about coconut oil um my hair looked so healthy at the, at the end of that video oh no you know what I'm thinking of the inversion method video that's the video you should watch that it's a pretty good informative video <laughs> in the end of that video my hair looks so healthy in my opinion um it wasn't that long in that video, but it got long over the year after I filmed that video. Now I caught off all that progress that I made, so yay. So I'm going to sort of go over with you guys some of the things that I was doing to my hair that maybe kind of damaged it a lot over the year. So almost every time I got out of the shower, I'd always use the It's a 10 Miracle Leave-In product just from like probably here down. And um, I would take this Chi Argan Oil and put four squirts into my hand and just like work it through my hair like this while it was still wet. And then I would either let it air dry or um, blow dry my hair. Which I don't put that much heat on my hair really at all unless I'm blow drying it, which is probably like... I don't know 20 times out of the year and then randomly I, I would use stuff like this and like a, a root boosting what is it called <laughs> a root booster spray if I'm blow drying my hair sometimes I'll spray this in this is a argan oil of Morocco healing dry oil I don't I've never really used this maybe a couple times so yeah and also for shampoo conditioner I use different stuff all the time so and it's never expensive stuff or anything like that. Honestly, a lot of time I'm using the Organics line, um, if you know what that is. So, yeah. Also, I don't know how great this is for your hair, but my hair is up in a bun or a ponytail a lot of the time. Like, probably 80% of the time, if I'm being honest. And I don't know if that's really great for your hair or not, but I'm pretty sure it's not. Oh, and then this is the main reason my hair it's ruined and I might have some pictures to put in here I don't know maybe I can find some um pretty much I I had this little point in time where I was letting my hair get knotted up like matted up in the back of my head completely matted up until I drew a lock or like one huge dreadlock It'd be like right here and um, either my boyfriend would take them out for me or I would sit there for hours and take it out one time it took him five hours to take it out of my hair just because I simply did not brush my hair for a few days and that was the outcome <laughs> and it was horrible and I try so hard not to do that anymore sometimes my hair gets a little matted just because it is really long if I don't brush it all day it will get pretty naughty but I can get it out pretty easily I can't really think of anything else I really do with my hair a lot I have my hair in braids sometimes but other than that I leave my hair pretty untouched um I'd say the reasoning for 
all of my breakage. And this is after I cut my hair, it was really bad, like yesterday. Um, I'd say the reason for all that is the matting in the back of my head, the dreadlocks, um, the knots, the ripping through it. Um, my hair is up all the time, that's probably not good for your hair. And stuff like that. Yeah. So I think that's all I kind of have to say about all the things I did to my hair. Um, so now we're going to get to the second portion of this video where I'm going to do a coconut oil treatment on my hair. And you guys can watch me. Or you can just stop watching the video right here if you want to. Um, <laughs> or you can continue watching and do this with me. Really fast, I'm going to brush my hair so you guys can see how my hair looks brushed because this is like not brushed hair. <laughs> um, I'll be right back. I mean, it kind of looks the same. <laughs> you get the point though, it's brushed, there's no knots in it right now, um, and it doesn't look that healthy. Also, in the lighting that I'm in right now, my hair looks pretty blonde, and I don't know why, but it's not. <laughs> my hair is actually dark brown, so don't mind that. I'm gonna show you guys my hair from the back one more time. Um, so this is my hair update. Okay, so now, oh, the lighting is horrible. So now we're on the ground, <laughs> and, um, we're going to begin applying coconut oil to my hair, just like I did in my old videos. Um, I'm not going to be explaining it too much, because I've done that in the other videos, so if you want to know what I'm doing exactly, what I'm doing it for, just go check out my other videos about my hair. Um, right now I'm just brushing it out. It's hard for me to get an angle so you guys can see like my whole hair. Here's the coconut oil I'll be using today. Butcher Boy Organic Coconut Oil Extra Virgin and Unrefined Coconut Oil. <laughs> I always use, you should use extra virgin and unrefined coconut oil. It's just better. Um, I use this for everything. I use it on my hair, on my face, on my skin. Everything. <laughs> I'm just going to start by digging my finger in there. <laughs> And simply applying it, I'm gonna start right where my, just start right in the middle, start massaging it in. Massaging your scalp is like the key to success, okay? So just putting coconut oil in, massaging into your scalp. I really like to take my time. Like when I'm talking about hair growth to somebody, I always have to tell them like, coconut oil, coconut oil, coconut oil. <laughs> coconut oil is what grew my hair. I mean, I, I've always had really long hair, like, on and off. I cut my hair off, it grew back. Long hair is kind of, like, my thing, like. <laughs> my hair grows pretty fast, I'd say, but coconut oil is a huge factor as to how my hair has been, like, really long lately. So 
So right now I'm just kind of doing it over here. Um, on this side, I'm gonna be starting on this side soon. And I'm just on the scalp right now. I'm not bringing it down or anything. I, I'm good. I will get to that though. Okay, so I think you guys get the point. I'm just gonna put this coconut oil all throughout my hair, scalp, massage into my scalp a lot, bring it all the way down to the ends, massage into my ends. Um, but for now on, you guys are gonna be in fast motion. So me, no more talkie talkie. So <laughs> see you guys in a little bit. Okay, my hair is finally completely saturated. I'd say it took me about 20 minutes, I don't know. Um, and I definitely do take my good old time because I love oiling my hair. It makes me feel really happy. <laughs> okay, so my hair is fully saturated. Um, I'm about to go eat dinner. I'm gonna leave this in for only like maybe two hours today. Um, I usually leave it in for like seven to 14 hours but I'll be back <laughs> so it's the end of the day now and my hair is all clean and dry from the coconut oil it's so soft <laughs> the coconut oil just makes the hair feel so soft and healthy my ends feel nice and thick actually thick and healthy so yeah I don't know what else to say for this video I hope you guys enjoyed my little hair update um there will be more hair videos on this channel of my growth things like that maybe some hair braiding videos if you want to see that the way I style my hair even though I don't style it I wake up with pin straight hair that's just how it is <laughs> um oh and one thing I I think I forgot to mention in like the beginning of this video I wash my hair it ranges from like once a week twice a week every other day it really ranges from whatever I'm doing that week I guess but yeah I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and please subscribe um <laughs> yeah I love you guys and goodbye I'll be inserting a clip also of a video that my boyfriend just took of my hair so that you guys can see it in its full glory and good lighting, things like that. <laughs>